the way it starts is, is we'll figure out a day that works well for you. Uh, you'll get a sheet that'll go through how to do a bowel cleanse, which is essentially a, a clear liquid diet the day before and, and then a, a cleansing solution um, that will clear your system so that we're able to get a good look looking at the colon. You'll come in the next day into the endoscopy unit. Uh, one of our gastroenterologists will see you as well as one of the anesthetists. Uh, and then uh, you'll have a small IV placed and uh, the anesthesia will make it to where you won't even know the colonoscopy is happening. You'll be asleep. Colonoscopy procedure is such that we take an um, endoscope, which is a tube with a light and a camera, and look in through the colon, uh, looking for these growths called polyps, which are growths on the colon wall that, if left alone, will grow up and become cancers. Uh, the nice thing about colonoscopy is we can both identify these polyps uh, and then remove them in order to prevent colon cancer from happening in the first place. Uh, we then uh, remove the scope, wake you up, show you the pictures. Uh, again, people say, I can't believe it was that easy. Afterwards then, uh, you just need a driver to drive you home that day. There's no incisions, there's no recovery from the procedure itself. It's really just a matter of letting the uh, anesthetic wear off that day. You can eat what you want when you leave that day. It's not like there are strict restrictions of what you can't have. Uh, and then the next day you're back you know, driving, working, doing all your normal stuff again, uh, just like you did the day before. Uh, hopefully with uh, a clean colonoscopy report and we see you again in 10 years.